It's just that grilled flavor. It's just above everything else. Today, we are trying each other's Hungry Jack's orders. So my relationship with Hungry Jack's is super nostalgic. Oh, Hungry Jack's, HJ's. Growing up, we didn't have a lot of money coming from an immigrant family, but every year on our birthday, our parents would take us to Hungry Jack's and we'd love it because free refills, got to wear cool paper hats. My memories of Hungry Jack's really revolve around car trips with my family. When you're going up the coast, Little halfway stop. Oh, look at that, it's a Hungry Jacks. Me and Hungry Jacks, we experimented a bit in uni, but that was about it. We left it there. It wasn't good for either of us. But now today, <laughs> going back down memory lane. My order from Hungry Jacks is a cheesy bacon tender crisp burger with peri peri sauce, chips, because the chips from Hungry Jacks are the best, honey mustard sauce, because gotta have some dunky dunky action going on for those chips, and then a raspberry fanta, because where else can you get that? This burger has like six adjectives in its name. Tender, crispy, chicken, cheese, bacon, peri peri, fucking smorgasbord of shit. Ooh. <gasps> A chicken burger. I feel like when you're at Hungry Jack's, why are you ordering anything other than beef? Oh, wow, it's giving me big Oporto's vibes. Yikes. Okay, well, that sauce is orange. It's orange. A little bit spicy. The chicken, succulent, but still crispy. The sauce, spicy, but not overwhelming. I have sauce everywhere. <laughs> That's a really good burger. The burger itself, super delicious. Wash it down with some raspberry fanta. I'm really not into like sweet flavory drinks except for Coke. It literally tastes like you took like an ice block and put it in a cup and it melted. And then you're like, shit, I forgot my ice block. And then you drink it because you're like, it's still an ice block. Honey mustard. The fuck? You don't need sauce with Hungry Jack's chips. They're actually pretty delicious on their own with the chicken salt. The honey mustardy sauce kind of does like mellow out the peri peri spiciness. So you know, Ryan loves a bit of balance in his food so I can see what he's doing here. Does the sauce make the chips better? I don't think so. So I think that's unnecessary. So I'm gonna deduct half a point for this monstrosity of a drink and half a point for the honey mustard sauce because we don't really need to or and I'm gonna give it a nine. It's good. Like a really good chicken burger. I think the element that's really letting it down is this raspberry Fanta. So because of that, like still a good meal, I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10. It's delicious. It's just a lot. I'm so sorry, but I've got to give it a five out of 10. And I love Hungry Jack's. This is just doing too much for me. My order is simple, delicious. It's the classic. It's the Whopper meal with a Sprite and a side of onion rings. I mean, it's all the best bits of Hungry Jack's in one go. Why would you order anything else? She's got a Hungry Jack's feast going on here. Yes, just yes. A classic Whopper, you can't go wrong. Whopper burgers, never tried them. Who is she? I don't know, but we're about to find out. And onion rings are my motherfucking favorite. <laughs> oh, it's just too greasy for me. You can see it on my fingers. Sometimes places do like soggy onion rings and they don't quite get it right. For fast food joint, these are boss. Like, that's awesome. I'm gonna eat this later. Chips, we all know what they taste like. Yum. Hefty burger. There's a lot of weight to this. Oh. And why put some? Cause the burgers are better at Hungry Jacks. Um, the burger's better at Hungry Jacks. It's a bit like the quarter pounder, isn't it, of Hungry Jacks. This doesn't look appealing to me, but my mind might be changed today. It's so classic. Wow. This is good, like, beef. Oh my God, there's a second meat patty in here. Surprise! <laughs> it's just that grilled flavor. It's just above everything else. <sighs> Wash that all down. Mm, it's like a good palate cleanser, because this is heavy. This is a good order. So I'm gonna have to give Nat's order a seven out of 10. I'm only deducting points because I don't eat red meat, so I wouldn't order this again. Um, and also the onion rings, unnecessary. Onion rings, banger. Burger, banger. Chips, banger. Drink, bam, bam. So for that, I'm gonna have to deduct points. But overall, this was still a really good meal and that's why you're getting a 9.5. Yo! I'm gonna give Nat a nine out of 10. She is top notch at ordering Hungry Jacks. So my order from Hungry Jacks is a grilled chicken burger 
Um, it didn't used to be, but I recently stopped eating red meat, so I kind of defaulted to my dad's favorite. So even when I eat it, I get super happy because it reminds me of my dad. And then I also get it with chips and a Coke Zero, which I know some people are gonna have an issue with, but deal with it. Who goes to a fast food place and gets Coke Zero Sugar? I don't even wanna to touch this. I am intrigued to try the classic chicken burger from Hungry Jack's. Like I said, I still think that you go to Hungry Jack's, you get a beef burger. Interesting choice, Amita. I'm a fried chicken guy myself. Grilled chicken burger. Are you serious? Oh, that looks so sad and lifeless. It's very saucy. It looks like it's got like a herb sauce into that. Hmm. The mayo is trying to do a lot. Like it's trying to make up for the fact that you've got like a dry ass piece of chicken in between some dry ass bugs. Would I prefer a deep fried burger more? Unfortunately, yes. Would I prefer a real Coke more? Also, unfortunately, yes. I think the only redeeming thing about this meal is the chips. It's edible, but it's not that enjoyable, you know? I'm probably gonna give it a five and a half out of 10. I'm gonna have to give you a two out of 10. So Hamida, for this meal, I'm so sorry. It's a good meal, but it's not great. So it's gonna get like a, a six from me. <clears throat> Here's my Hungry Jack's order. Normally I get a hash brown burger and a frozen Coke, but <clears throat> they don't do them past 11 a.m. So we're gonna do the next best thing, my dad's order. Hang on. I'm just shooting a video at work. What for? For, <laughs> he doesn't now understand that, what we do. I make myself look cool then. <laughs> um, what's the burger you get from Hungry Jack's? The burger, it's a veggie burger. What's good about it? Uh, it's got no animal. Uh... <laughs> All right, I got to be sick. <laughs> All right. Have a great day. Okay, you too. Bye. Bye. Love you. <laughs> well, there you have it. My orders now: uh, veggie Whopper burger. So yeah, enjoy. So veggie Whopper. Um, trying it because I haven't tried it before. Dad, this one's for you. Um, but I'm not ranking it because we got to keep those scores even. Mmm, yum. I mean, if I could give it a score, it would get a 10 out of 10 for me. But obviously I can't. But Dad, good, good picking. Okay, so first impressions, Zoddy's dad come through with the big opinions. Not sure if he's vegan or if this is just a bloody great burger. It's hefty, it's like the Whopper. It's like very big. I always forget how giant Hungry Jack's burgers are. Oh, double patty. This looks so good. That's actually really good. I'm surprised. It tastes like when you go to a bougie breakfast and you get you some corn fritters, this is what that tastes like in a burger version. I'm surprised the patties are actually really delicious and flavorful rather than just being like a cardboard vegan patty. I actually don't mind it. I think it's definitely better than a grilled chicken. Chase it with a frozen Coke. Frozen Coke, classic. Like sloping down one of these on a hot summer's day in the car trip, nothing better. So iconically Australian. I would absolutely order this again. Like I am probably gonna give it like an eight out of 10. I'm gonna give this a six out of 10, just cause I like it a bit more than I thought. I think an eight out of 10 and that's a lot for a vegan burger and I'm surprising myself, but honestly, if you haven't tried it yet, you should try it. Woo! I mean, obviously it's the classic, it's the best, get on it. Um, Nat, yes, queen. If you'd like to see more of us trying other stuff, comment below, let us know what you'd like us to try next.